Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to RL Alrighty, your host, RL. And this is the continuation of the stages of the book process. And this is stage one, ideas. Step four, decisions, the passion. After having decided that what you're going to write about and do, whether you're going to write one thing or many things, pick a plot for your idea and a conflict of interest. A subject. What is the theme behind the idea? Design and categorize these ideas in your mind. And, most important, you need passion. Will be, what will be the plot of your idea? There can be multiple plots, even plot twists. That all depends on what you want to happen and how you want it to happen. What is the conflict that gets your idea to what it is. What is the subject or the idea in question? What is the overarching theme of your idea? <clears throat> what is the overarching theme of your idea? Design your idea and categorize these as you write them down in your notes and from your mind. Passion. You gotta have passion for your ideas. If you lack passion, you're not going to care about your idea, or ideas, or your story, which will only result in half-hearted work that won't count for anything. If this is your approach, your readers won't care for it either. If you're going to commit to an idea, or ideas, and you want to write something about it, you need passion to do this. It's going to take time. However short or long, it's going to take time. It's going to take effort. You're going to need to fly past the blocks that prevent you from reaching and achieving your goal or goals. Don't let you get in the way of you. Your readers will have the passion to read what you write with the passion that you put into it. And they will put forth the effort into reading what you write if you put forth the effort into what you write. It's not about the quantity of the words or the amount of time spent. It's about the quality of your words. The quality of the time spent. The quality of your effort and the quality of your passion, how much quality you invest in yourself and in your writing, how much quality you invest in yourself to your writing. I would say out of my own personal experience are my four biggest tips and advice. Passion, effort, quality, and investment. Thank you for your love support. Love and peace till next we meet.